guys, Ariel here from Fix My Books and today I will teach you how to record an HST payment with the bank fee. So I get this question all the time. Okay, I paid my HST but I paid it using a third party provider like Pay Simply because I wanted to pay using my credit card, right? So if you use your um, CRA make a payment, the online service, then you can only pay via debit card or like direct debit, something like that. So if you want to pay using any other method besides like a pre-authorized debit or direct debit, you will have to use a third party provider like pay simply. So it will have an additional fee, but some people are okay with the fee because they want to pay with a credit card. That's fine. So I'll show you how to do that. So all we need to do is go to your QuickBooks online account. And I have a sample company here for the demo. Let's pretend that this Air Express is actually the CRA payment. So you can see the amount owing is three four fifty, but what we were charged was three four five eight point thirty, and again there's an additional eight dollars and thirty cents as a bank fee, as a convenience fee for using the Pay Simply service. So how do we record the payment? So now we'll just click Prepare Return. Pretend everything's already filed, we're done. So we'll click mark as filed, that's fine. This is not a filing thing. This is how we record the payment, okay? So we'll just click pay later so you see how that looks like. Now there's a balance owing here, 3450. So now we want to record the payment for this. So we'll click record payment, but we need an additional $8.30. So we'll do it. We paid using the checking account and then it's September 26. And then all we need to do is to click add interest or penalty. But the adjustment account, it's obviously not an interest. So $8.30 and then we'll date it also at, oh, sorry. We'll put it as $8.30 over here. And then we'll date it September 26 as well. But for the adjustment account, instead of penalties and interest, we will just put it as bank charges so that the $8.30 will be there. And we'll click save. And then you can see that the total payment is 3458.30. Even though it says penalties and interest, don't worry, that will go to the bank fees. So we'll click record payment. And you can see it still says 3450 here. It's not saying 3458. But if we actually, we'll go out and then we'll go back. You see how now it says one match found for that exact amount? And then we'll just click match. And then if we go to reports and the profit and loss report, you will see that the October bank fees, I'll just do all dates, and you will see that in the bank charges, there's a bank charge of $8.30 on September 29. So that is how you record an HST payment with a bank fee. Hey guys, it's Ariel here from Fix My Books. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and helping my YouTube channel grow. If there are any videos you want to see on my channel, please don't hesitate to comment them down below. I always listen to your feedback. And once again, this is Ariel from Fix My Books, helping you fix your books.